chances are you have them all around your house and you probably don't really even notice them. Tonight, ABC6 News reporter Dan Conrad has a story of a local man who was inspired to follow his dream and is helping restore memories in the process. Taking an old dirty clock movement that isn't running and getting it to run again is very satisfying. Bill Porter calls his shop Born Again Clocks. And you can interpret Born Again in a couple of ways. It brings back life into the clocks. I believe that God has directed me in this direction. It all started one day on a roof. All my life I've worked construction. One day I was standing on an old farmhouse roof. And I asked God, I said, uh, uh, when I grow up, uh, please give me something else to do. And sometimes the Lord works in mysterious ways. Shortly after that, I went into our bathroom and one of my wife's favorite little plastic clocks broke. He knocked my clock off the wall and um, I love clocks. And I was in big trouble. So Bill Porter went in search of a replacement for the broken clock. I bought a clock from a fella and he said it ran and it didn't run. So uh, I decided to take it apart and figure out why it wasn't running. Uh, what I found myself doing was racing home from a job to work on the clock. And before long, clocks became a career, a hobby, and a calling. The theory of clocks, there's, there's so much to learn. You see, I got another microscope here for inspection. The mechanics of a, of a clock are appealing. Where does that calming effect come from with a ticking clock? Possibly from when we were in the womb. And in an age when we're more likely to learn the time from this than from this. Our new technology is, is good. It does a lot of good things, but it can, uh, it can also take away. A clock is a time machine. The stories behind the clock, when they see that clock running and they hear it chime again or strike the hour, and it brings back the, the memories of grandma or grandpa. Touching one person's life is what, what we're all about. And people, like clocks, can be born again. If you talk to my wife, <laughs> she'll say that I'm uh, a little calmer, uh, a little more at peace with what I'm doing. He just has a much better attitude towards life and towards everything around him because he enjoys what he does. It's what you can give that's intangible. Love and, and kindness. Dan Conrad, ABC 6 News. Absolutely. A lesson for all of us. Well, if you'd like to learn more about Bill Porter's Born Again Clocks, head to our website at KALTV.com and click on links.